I'd like to invite you to this concert this weekend. In many ways, it's a tale of two empires. Elgar's mighty first symphony was written in 1907 and marks the apogee of the British Empire. The Golden Age, pre-First World War, Downton Abbey, all that stuff. But it really feels like the sun is setting and this sense of majestic hope that permeates all the way through the symphony is one of the greatest and most moving pieces of all. And in our first half, this really feels like the rise of the American Empire. In 1907, Charles Ives wrote the extraordinary piece, Central Park in the Dark. This piece is about a city which is about to be built. The sound sitting there in the Central Park, a sense of silence. New York has not had silence in Central Park for a long time. The sounds of parties, jollity, different things coming, but also a modernism about to grow. Samuel Barber's wonderful violin concerto, written in 1939, is full of poignancy, pathos, and a real sense of American language. We recognize aspects of Korngold, of Copeland, of something identifiably American. Mid 20th century, the American musical empire has absolutely come up. Do join us on Friday in Tampa, Saturday in St. Petersburg, and Sunday in Clearwater for what will be three evenings of memorable music making.